What's going on everybody? So I'm back in the video. Hope everyone's having a great day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get files to escape on iOS 16.1.2 or below. So fortunately, if you are running 16.2 or 16.3, you will not be able to do this because it does only support 16.1.2 or below. So if you don't know what files escape is, it's basically a full file manager for your iOS device. So this does not require a computer or a jailbreak. So the first thing you want to do is head to the Safari application and you want to go to the website Zeus.me. And once you guys are on the website, there is going to be ad right here. Uh, just click on close. And what you want to do is look for something called Mac Dirty Cow Apps. So you will notice that it does support 16.1.2 all the way uh, to iOS 14. So we're gonna click on browse right here and you want to scroll down until you see a files escape right here. So browse root file system and no jailbreak. So we're gonna tap on a get and then tap on get again. And we'll ask you to open in iTunes, just tap on open. And then you guys should get the prompt if you want to install the application. So click on install. If you don't just delete this page and then go back and try again. So you'll notice it is gonna be already dialing onto my device. So when we do open up for the first time, it's going to say untrusted uh, enterprise developer. So to fix this problem, you want to go into the settings application and I'm going to go all the way back here, go to general, scroll down to VPN and device management, and then look for that profile and trust and verify it. So once you have done that, we can now open up the application without getting that little pop up. And when you do open up for the first time, it's going to ask you a uh, request access to the sandbox dot read. Uh, dash right you want to click on ok and there you guys have it you now have a full file manager on your ios device so there are a lot of cool things you can do if you go over on reddit uh there's a lot of cool customization so i'm gonna leave a link down below in the description maybe some tutorials in the future but there you guys have it if you did enjoy the video drop a like on it, it helps me out a ton hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys never miss a video and that's basically it and i'll see you guys in the next one.